So I'm here today at Dork's Music with a rather lovely second-hand buffet bass clarinet. Um, so this is a low E flat bass clarinet, so it's down to the low E flat, it hasn't got the bottom C. Um, and it is a slightly older buffet, so this is from when they were actually still making them in France. Um, I have to say this is one of the nicest bass clarinets I've tried, so I'm just going to play you a little bit more on it. <laughs> So hopefully as you can hear, that's a really fun bass clarinet to play and it's got a really gorgeous sound. The thing that struck me when I first picked up this bass is how rich and deep the sound is. It's one of the biggest, most resonant sounding bass clarinets I've tried and I think um, in comparison with some of the newer models, because this one's been played in a bit and also because it is one of the ones that was um, made in France, it's just got that amazing depth to sound from it. Um, I mentioned earlier it's down to the low E flat, um, so it goes down to... So if you're switching over from a B-flat clarinet, most B-flats just go down to a written E, and almost all bass clarinets go to the E-flat, a semitone lower like this, and then you can get ones down to low C as well. Um, the low C is really only needed by professionals or if you're doing a lot of orchestral work where you need those notes. But if you don't need that, um, you can save yourself a lot of money with an E-flat, um, a low E-flat bass clarinet, and some people prefer them as well. They often feel a little bit more nimble. They're also smaller to carry around, which is um, nice, and this is a particularly lovely example. Um, I mentioned carrying it around. Of course, it does come with a case. Um, it comes with the original buffet case, which is um, a rather nice case to have, um, and obviously fits the clarinet perfectly, so it's nice that that's included with the second-hand sale as well. Um, I should mention as well, being second-hand, save probably about a thousand pounds off the new equivalent, which is a really nice um, saving to have. Um, of course, with it coming from Dorks as well, it's been checked out in the in the workshop. They've set it all up, and actually, it's playing absolutely gorgeously. So, whatever they've done in the workshop, between that and the instrument being made, they've done a brilliant job on this. So, as I said, this is a really amazing bass clarinet. If you're in the market for a low E flat bass clarinet. Um, it could be your first bass clarinet, it could be an upgrade bass clarinet, it could be for playing in bands, um, you could just fancy trying one out. Then I'd get yourself down to Dorks and try this one out before it's gone. <laughs>